Hi, I'm Peter Haddock, and this is Peter, and we're on the stand here with a brand new wheeled excavator that is all electric, and it's literally built from the ground up, isn't it? That's right, yeah. So we're at the business end here now, and what I want to talk is integration. So see all the stuff we've got here. Talk to me about how you're integrating things to make it simpler for people to use, but also protecting key lines like hydraulic lines. So... We've been, we've been in this business for quite some time because we're, we're doing conversion from diesel to electric. But a lot of time, there's a lot of options that need to be integrated. Yeah. So we, because we designed this machine from scratch, we, we decided to integrate already a lot of systems like tilt rotator, tilt rotator controls, yeah. like the GPS system, the 3D machine control systems, yeah. but also like central automatic greasing and extra hydraulic options. And so what we got here, this is an important block, isn't it? What does this do? It is. So, so what the block is doing, it's uh, you can couple very quickly a sorting grab or any hydraulic tools. And then also it'll, it'll stay on the tilt rotator at the same time. Right. Fantastic. Above us, though, folks, here, something really cool. So there's a camera here, but it's got a camera with some lighting on it. Just makes sense, doesn't it? What's that designed to do? So there can be situations where the operator does not see. It. So to increase safety, we have come up with a camera system and a light that, be, that can be visible on the job site, where, exactly what he's doing there. And also appears the NCON system as well that gives them that visibility when they've detached or whatever is on the end of it. And that's correct. So when we talk about all of the sensors and everything, everything is actually built in as much as possible, isn't it? That's right. It's not, not only to protect all these cables, all these connectors and all these hydraulic lines, but it also has static, right? So it's, it's very s smooth. It's very simple yeah and it, it'll it'll protect the machine and, and be like for the long term it will be a more uh, protectable system but when we talk about wheeled excavators they are a workhorse so we need to couple it up but sensible you've put all the auxiliary stuff here and you put the charging port here so it's about time we talked about battery life what's the battery life and how have you managed to squeeze all of that into this machine the battery life for this machine is 10 hours so 10 hours uptime right but you've said to me earlier, it's smaller because you've managed to do things much more cleverly from your experience. How have you managed to do that? So the main thing is that we looked at the driving of the machine. Yep. A lot of people drive to the job site yep. and then they go home in the evening. So the, the driving takes a lot of energy. Yep. So together with ZF, we, we developed the drive system, the E-Drive, and that saves a lot of energy. ZF, electric drive, optimization of boom structure smarter hydraulics we could save 28 percent of energy compared to the previous machine wow that's a lot of energy folks that gives you the ability to to, to make this machine really quite compact as well then doesn't that's it right. so come on the most important thing with any machine particularly when you're at bauman you need somewhere to sit down that's really comfy the big cab come in here and uh, so Really key thing with wheeled excavators, obviously we've got the accessibility that's just here to get inside it, haven't we? But when we're inside, you said to me earlier, we had a young person, a young operator come up with his dad, right? So you've got a big touch screen and it is big folks in there, which he loved, the young operator. The dad said, no, I prefer the buttons. But you've thought about that as well, haven't you? It's all in there. So for the young guys, we have the touchscreen. Yeah. We, have, we have all the features inside of the touchscreen. Uh, but we also looked at what do, they, what do what the operators need. So uh, for the old guys, we have the direct touch, heating, cooling system, radio, as it was before. So you can directly touch these buttons, yep. but also go into the, to the touchscreen. What's important is safety and the integral elements of safety. Two points there, 360 and a drone view. But tell me what a drone view is. So it's really funny. The drone view will see you can see yourself into the machine, and then it's the the the, the visibility is is taken from a couple of meters away from the machine. Yep. So you see the actual job site, yep. and you see where you're getting at. So therefore, you see more around you. That's great. And then what we've got is really something interesting. You told me. Haptic controls. So when you're when you're operating, obviously very very smooth. Uh, the, the the controls you've got in there, some really nice joysticks. But when somebody comes close to the machine, 
you get an alert from the joysticks. That's something new. That's an AI safety system. Tell me why you've done it like that and how it actually works uh, in that context. It is. So uh, the AI safety system is working like this. So if there's a person coming into your working area, yep. it will give you a signal. And the signal is, it is in the screen, yep. but it's also in the joysticks. And it starts with a soft vibrating in the joysticks. The closer the, the person will get in your working area, the more intense of the vibrating will come from the joysticks. And at the end, when, the, when there is a person entering the machine so closely, it will yeah. stop. Right, so it's automatic system, so it's an active system. And it's about time we revealed the really exciting, very, very big Fusion battery system. Now, the Fusion system is something that you've been using for some time. So actually, you know, we've got a power box there as well, which, which you use for other customers. Yes. But Fusion system, that is everything in there that is required, isn't it? Yes. Yes, so the battery itself is 300 kilowatt hour, yep. which enables the operator to work with the machine for 10 hours. Yep. And it can be ch uh, uh, charged by a fast charger directly on the machine. Yep. And it can also be charged by a fast charger outside of the machine. Yep. Charging time is two hours yep. with a fast charger. And with a normal AC output, it can be charged overnight. And of course, folks, because it's a wheeled machine, you can pick up the box over there, which is, and take that with you so that you can power a whole job site with the Power Hub as well, can't That's you? That's correct, yeah. Fantastic. One, two, why? Okay, <laughs> so to optimize the cooling system, we have split the cooling system in, in two divisions. Right. So one is cooling the hydraulics, and the other one is cooling the electrical components. The temperature of the cooling is different, yeah. so that's why we have the op optimized uh, cooling system to cool the, all these different components. And folks, if you notice here, there's some pretty cool lights, yeah? But there's also a great big bar with some lights on it. But you mentioned earlier, we could have really, really big coverage by just adding more and more and more, can't we? It's up to the customers. They want to make the machine as beautiful as a Christmas tree, yeah. they can. The bar is, uh, is, is there for to, uh, to put as many lights on as they want. Okay, and now the other thing is, obviously, when we talk about machines like this, we talk about the connectivity and, and, and maintenance and things like that as well. That's really important, isn't it? So you've got the customers covered there. Yes, yes, we do. So fundamentally, we have a machine designed by people that have been retrofitting machines that we've thought about all of the different elements, integrated them all so that fundamentally we've got something that people can walk in and go, if I'm an older operator, I want a touch screen, job done. If I want to be safer on site, I can get that vibration, job done. If I want to have the power to do 10 hours and more, job done. If I want a tilt rotator, job done. It's all done, isn't it? It Cheers. is. It's great to see you. Cheers.